Raheem Morris coming over to the Atlanta Falcons organization from the LA Rams as the new head coach. He brings along Zach Robinson as his offensive coordinator. Their job, find a way to bring some more explosive plays to the Atlanta Falcons offense. So I thought we'd take a look back at some of the explosive plays for the Rams last year and how we might see those in a black and red jersey next year. So here's a game from the Cleveland Browns last year where it looks to me like Matt Stafford's making an audible at the line of scrimmage because he sees that there is so much space right here in the middle of the field that he wants to take advantage of. Well, the interesting thing is he's going to get his wide receiver, Puka Nakua, is going to be in the slot, and he's just going to run a skinny post here. Stafford knows that he's got to get the ball just over the top of this linebacker to get a big play. And oddly enough, this they're playing like an invert defense, so this defender is going to actually buzz out to the flat, which is going to open up the hole even more. So as the ball comes back, Stafford knows, I just got to get this ball over the head of the linebacker. He does just that. Puka Nakua does the rest, 70-yard touchdown for the Rams. Well, if it's not Puka Nakua, it could be Cooper Cup. Well, let's take a look at another play. So this is going to be Cooper Cup. He's going to come across the formation in motion. And what's going to happen is the motion, which has been a staple for Sean McVay and his offenses, is going to cause confusion for the commanders. So Cup is going to come out, and as he comes up field, there's going to be three defenders that actually end up getting stuck on one player. You got one, two, three players that are looking at Demarcus Robinson. The closest person to be able to make a play on Cooper Cup is this safety right here. Well, as Cooper Cup ends up making this catch, you're gonna end up seeing that this safety is, let's call it 19 yards away. I like my chances for a wide receiver to score a touchdown when you have that much space. Well, let's take a look at one more. So this is a crossing route here from Puka Nakua, but it's third at inches. Again, really good season from Kyron Williams, the running back. And Cooper Cup's gonna come across the formation in motion. So right now, Stafford knows that he has man coverage. Well, on the snap, Cooper Cup is gonna come across the formation. He's gonna end up taking the defender with him after the snap again, which is gonna open up this hole. Now this just ends up being a two-man route. Demarcus Robinson up top, he's gonna to run a clear route, and then you're gonna end up seeing Nakua, who's gonna hesitate here, and then he's gonna come across the formation on a crossing route, just a two-man route, and he's gonna end up being open. Again, third and inches, linebackers are thinking that they're gonna run the ball, they come up, there he is, wide open, Stafford puts the ball out in front, First down, explosive play for the Rams. So it's just an example, three different plays and how the Rams end up using motion, shifting, and finding ways to get explosive plays to keep moving the football down the field and ultimately punch it into the end zone for a touchdown.